Hello everyone, this is Anuj from Gadget Cake. Shooting high quality videos is really easy these days, be it from your smartphone or professional DSLR camera. But to process these videos from raw to finished, they need to be edited. And today in this video, I'm going to show you the easiest and the best editing software available for your computer. So let's start. We get so many questions on our videos, which software is best for editing and how much time does it take to edit videos. And lot of people think that editing a video is really difficult and complicated. Which is to be honest, depends upon the tools you have available and of course your ability to learn. But today we have the easy and user friendly video editor from Moavi and it's the Moavi Editor Plus. I've been using it for quite some time and I find this software really easy to use. Moavi Video Editor Plus is available for both Mac and Windows. So first let me show you the interface. So when you open the software, you get two options, full feature mode and the easy mode, which is montage. First let me show you the main feature of this software, so we will go to the full feature mode. Interface of the software is like any other video editing software, but everything is placed perfectly and neatly presented. You have the timeline at the bottom, which has the separate timeline for videos and audio. And on the top you have the option to import media files or you can just record the live video. So let's start by importing a video. I'm going to import a video on which I was recently working and it's a Zap Bluetooth earphones. So you can see we have the video in the timeline and here you can select the part which you want from the video. You can either use the shortcut command or use the toolbar on the top to select the split video tool. You can also do adjustments by going to the tool option such as stabilization, color adjustment and slow motion. I have tested the stabilization and the software stabilized the video pretty good. Apart from that, the toolbar on the top of the timeline has the option like rotate, crop and you can also record the audio live and add it to your timeline. In the import menu, you also have the option to add free music and sample videos to your project. For example, these are the available free music which you can use. And here are some sample videos which can be used to give some special effects to your videos. Let me show you one quickly. These sample videos can be used as an overlay on your current video and you can use them according to your requirement. This video editing software also has lot of filters and transition which are really easy to use. And to apply a filter, you just need to drag and drop the filter to the video file. And same for the transitions which can be applied in between two video files. And I must say that these transitions are really good and very smooth. Text is also an important part of the video and the type of text and font you use leave a great impact on your viewers. But Moavi Video Editor Plus offers easy to use and some great looking text preset. These text presets can be easily edited which includes font, color and size. These preset text include animation which looks really good. If you're a vlogger, then you know how important it is to use stickers in your videos. They look interesting and also engage your audience. In this editor, you have lots of stickers available to use. And apart from stickers, there are also call-out stickers available. Adding them to your timeline is really easy. Just drag and drop, adjust the placement and that's it. Some of these callouts are animated, but there is also an animation option by which you can animate your stickers. These animations are really easy to use and you can animate stickers and even videos. For example, if you have seen my other videos, in the end screen, I animate the video to fit in the screen. And in Moavi, you just need to click on animate and it will add two keyframes to the timeline. So in the first keyframe you have the starting position and in the second keyframe you have the finishing position. And when you play it, it gives you this smooth animation. One more feature of the Moavi Video Editor Plus is Chroma Key option or as some people call it green screen effect. It is easy to use and with the adjustment options you can apply the Chroma Key effect smoothly to your videos. You can add image as a background or use one of their sample video. And the final part once you're done with the editing is the exporting the final version. You can either save it as a file on a computer or upload it directly to your YouTube channel. In the YouTube export option, you can select the title, resolution, description and even the tags for your videos which is pretty handy. Rendering the video doesn't take that long and on my MacBook Pro, it took almost the same time of the video length which is actually pretty fast. 
So apart from full feature mode, you also have the easy mode or the montage mode where you just have to select the video files, music, transition and the duration of the video. Once the video is processed, you can see the live preview and then export it as a file on a computer or upload directly to your YouTube channel. So basically in this mode, it auto select the best part of your videos and compile them in a form of storyline. That's really very good option if you want to save time. Overall, I find the Moavi Video Editor Plus really good and if you're looking for an easy user-friendly editor for your Mac or PC, then definitely check it out. We were able to get the discount on the personal version and you can get it for Rs 1400, which is really an amazing deal. And at this price, the options and features you are getting are definitely worth every single penny. You can also try the 7 days trial version before buying the full version. And if you have any questions about this software, just let us know in the comment section below. And we will try to answer them as soon as we can. So that's it guys, this was the Moavi Video Editor Plus. Let us know if you like this software and comment below which video editing software you use to edit your videos. So that's all for now. If you like this video, please press the like button and subscribe to our channel Gadget Geek for more videos like this. Once again, this is Anuj signing off and I'll see you in the next one.